Good morning, everybody. So most of you probably don't really even know what's going on <laughs> with me. I have not recorded anything about my life in quite a while. Um, but I'll, I'll get into that in a different video later, and I don't know when that will be. But um, as far as my weight loss goes, things are going really good with my weight loss. I'm down 128 pounds total, and it's been seven and a half months since my surgery, so that's great. Um, but what's going on with me now is most of you probably know that my weight loss surgery was just a means to get me to be able to have another surgery, um, which is to fix my incontinence that was caused by my tumor removal two years ago. Um, when they removed my tumor the last time, they accidentally paralyzed my urethra. Um, and so I've been completely incontinent for two years and I had to lose weight in order to have surgery to get that fixed. And that surgery is happening today. Now it's not the surgery that I was hoping it was going to be, but just for a bunch of reasons, that surgery wasn't gonna pan out the way um, we wanted it to for our life and family and such. So, um, so yeah, but I'm actually going to be checking in. I'm in Seattle right now. I can give you this lovely roof view from my hotel. This is my hotel right here. And the hospital is literally right there. So the hotel is attached to the hospital, which is cool and convenient and such. My sister came with me this time so that Dan could stay home with the kids and help my mom take care of them. So that way Dan can go to work and my mom can take care of the kids while he's at work. But yeah, so basically what they're doing today is they're just gonna be taking some flesh from either my, some tissue rather, from my thigh or my abdomen. And they're going to basically be making, like tying it around. I, I'll go into more detail in a different video, but they're basically gonna be tying it around my urethra and trying to like close it off enough so that I'm not leaking anymore. Um, and that's, that's the goal. It's an, it's supposed to be outpatient. So I shouldn't be in Seattle more than until tomorrow, which I hope not because our flight leaves tomorrow. <laughs> so, um, they might keep me overnight. They said they probably won't have to. So I'll probably just be staying here at the hotel tonight and then flying home tomorrow. So, so yeah, I just, I noticed a lot of people were confused as to why I was in Seattle. So I figured I would do an update, just let everybody know what's going on. If I could get your thoughts and prayers and good vibes and whatever coming my way today, I'm really, it's hard to have hope for this surgery when I've had so many surgeries not go the way I wanted them to, but I want to have hope that this will work. Um, because we've tried so many things for my incontinence at this point that it's, it is really hard to be hopeful, but I, I want to have hope and I, I have, I have as much hope as my body is allowing me to have without having a massive panic attack. So, um, so yeah, so that's what's going on. I hope you guys are doing good. Um, just send me your thoughts today and I will definitely be keeping everybody posted on my social media and such. So Anyways, thanks guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later.